Hey, Pastor Steve Waldron, New Life Pentecostal Church, Albany, Georgia. I hope you're having a great day in Jesus. We're going to take a quick walk through some sales from Christian book distributors. And so I just bought some sales stuff, incredible sales stuff, and they have some really good deals. So we're just going to take a quick look through here. Hope I can get it all done in one video. Won't try to keep you long. May have to turn it into two or three like I did last time. So let's see. On the, this one, the, I only want to show you uh, a couple things. The first is this book by Robbie Zacharias called Jesus for five dollars. Five dollars. You can get that code off there. Sometimes I've noticed, like if you go to the Christian Book Distributors website, the price will be different. So you'll need that code. You can also just get the. Um, uh, what am I saying? Get the on their mailing list. Mailing list is what I'm trying for here. And get this as well in hard copy. And then the next thing is this Action Bible down at the bottom. They've redone the Action Bible. Get some extra bells and whistles. And another cool thing is, is while supplies last, they've got uh, the Action Bible comic book, which is really cool as well. So I just wanted to show you these two out of this particular catalog. This is the September, October catalog. Lord willing, you'll be probably seeing this in uh, October. And so 128 brand new page illustrations in the Action Bible. Now this is the clearance. This is Fall 220 clearance. And I'll just show you some things and I mark some different things that I may mention along the way. Some good deals, some amazing deals. One of the great deals on the front of this is the Vines Bible. This is by Jerry Vines, the great preacher down at First Baptist in Jacksonville. We have some disagreements doctrine, but a really good Bible. And so if you get Bibles, you know, you guys know I'm a King James guy, but you can get New King James, read the notes. I don't think they make it in King James, but that is really good. That's one of the things I noticed on the front here. $13.49 for a $44.99 hardback. Um, the genuine leather is normally hundred dollars. It's thirty-seven ninety-nine, so that's good. Also, make mention of uh, Eric Metaxas, Martin Luther. That was a big deal when it came out. Thirty dollars. That's from Viking, and it's six ninety-nine. Eric Metaxas is Socrates in the city. You probably see him on YouTube, and he hosts these like Bible study symposiums on I think it's Wall Street somewhere around there, and called Socrates in the City. Um, in fifty-two ways to connect with your your smartphone obsessed kid, $2.99, normally $12.99. I thought that was something you may need. Um, and here I am, Lord, send somebody else by Jill Briscoe, which the Briscoes were the ones that did Out of the Salt Shaker and Into the World, which is a Christian classic. As you're looking at this one side, I'll be telling you some sales on the other side and then vice versa. KJV Thinline Reference Bible, normally $19.95, on sale for $5.99. And then another neat thing is Wesley Bible Studies. Bible Studies from an uh, Arminian viewpoint. And then the ESV S Student Study Bible. I'm, I'm going to have to check. I can't remember if I did a review on that or not. If I haven't, I want to get that to do a review if the Lord supplies the funds. Um, and then I thought this was a great idea. The message of Christmas booklets with door hangers and bags, $29.99 for 100 copies, door hangers and bags. I was like, that's amazing. But obviously, as you guys know, I'm not a huge fan of that, of the message. And then The Power of a Praying Wife, gift edition, good price. That's a good book. And then Christmas Carols, $449, Andrew Gant. It looks like that would be good. And then another Seven Men, Seven Women by Eric Metaxas, $599. That's good. And you might be seeing some other things. Like I'm seeing this uh, paraplegic on here doing a handstand, $2.99, normally $19.99. That's, you know, incredible. And then a lot of stuff for children here. Now, I didn't really mark a lot of stuff for children, uh, but Sunday school, you know, it's Christmas coming up. It's kind of reason I felt led to do this. I'm, I'm really... Uh, 
you know, maybe just in a season I'm feeling like if, the, if we could just flood the world with Christian materials that it would be a benefit. And that this may be a good time to do that. It seems like there's a lot of upheaval in the world. I'm going to turn around to the other side here. Other side. And I didn't notice just any incredible deals. Um, a lot of different translations, stuff like that. Some of you may be into that. Some of you may not. I'm not, but obviously I'm not addicted. I, don't, I just try to present evidence and love people, share the truth of the Word of God with people. And so here's more Bibles for kids, children. I know one time, who was I talking to? I was talking to somebody with maybe the Nation of Islam or something, or I can't remember. It's been many years ago. I used to work at Berean Christian Stores Atlanta had some conversation but it may not have even been there but they said one reason we know uh, you guys are devils because you call your children kids kids are goats I was like well uh, I don't think that's like uh, germane to the point but uh, so that's the reason a lot of times I don't use the term kids I use the term children's like Zonder kids like the NIRV Veggie Tales Bible oh man see I just overlooked that I'm gonna have to the Veggie Tales Bible the NIRV Superheroes Bible of course the NIRV I've done a review on that and the ICB International Children's Bible as well but the NIRV was like a revised NIV that a lot of people didn't like and so they decided to come out with it for children um, then under two dollar deals this that's a good page right there <laughs> under two dollars this is what like I get for Christmas presents for our church for our staff many times I'm presbyter here in South Georgia so I may get some like to give out to the ministry here and a lot of different things and seeing some Max Lucado books on the cross and hope on the side I'm looking at for $4.99 of course it's very difficult to go wrong with most anything Max Lucado does um, even though we would disagree uh, doctoring like tortured for Christ for 99 cent if you get them in packs of 10 that's one thing you want to notice like it says $1.49 but up top it'll say buy 10 or more 99 cent each Tortured for Christ was one of the greatest books ever written. He was in the old uh, Iron Curtain. Incredible. This is Why Is There a Cross? Am I Codependent? That's pretty interesting. Actually, I didn't have that mark. That was just where I stopped looking one time. And then here's HCSB Bibles. That's Holman Christian Standard Bibles. Uh, a lot of people, a lot of you have commented on the channel. Surprised me that you were very upset that Broadman Holman quit publishing HCSBs. One thing that happened, though, since they went out of print, you can get some amazing, incredible deals. I'm also looking at an MAV Spirit-Led Woman's Bible for $11.99, normally $44.99. And then there's a, another NIV Veggie Tales Bible that I've got both those marked. The Archaeological Study Bible. The better one, I don't like the ESV Archaeology Bible nearly as well. I did a comparison on the two. I've done individual reviews and then a comparison. Um, but it shows you can get gift cards here, all kind of stuff. But uh, those are some good things there. The MEV is a Textus Receptus non-King James Bible. I still like King James better. I think it's more accurate. But the MEV, a lot of people are like, well, I would, you know, if you want a Textus Receptus Bible, uh, on and on and so forth. Um, well, let's go on to this page. They've also got an amazing deal on this particular Bible. This is a tour de force of a Bible right here, the CSB Baker Illustrated Study Bible. Normally $50 for hardback. It's on sale for $12.99. Normally you can also get a deal uh, where you get free shipping if you'll sign up for their email specials and stuff like that. Um, also, if you pay five bucks, I used to be a part of this. I'm not any longer. They give you a lot of special deals for some five buck thing. I noticed the NKJV Reader's Bible. Some of you are into the NKJV um, as well. So that's about all. She might be seeing some stuff 
that uh, I'm not talking about. Here's the HCSB Gospel Project Bible, normally $39.99 for $9.99, it looks like. I think I've done a review on this Amplified Topical Bible. It's on sale. NKJV Study Bible, good price. Which, you know, the notes, a lot of good notes in there, even if you don't care for the translation. Um, let's see if there was anything that I mark on this side. It's got the Fire Bible, uh, KJV Teen Study Bible. Nothing that just really stood out to me as some amazing deal or anything like that. So I didn't mark anything. CEB Women's Bible. Oh, no, that's not a great deal anyhow. But um, yeah, just not seeing anything. A lot of times in these little, they'll have little things at the picture. They'll just say like more. You can get some really good deals in those sections here. Um, on the side I'm looking at that you're not looking at, I'm seeing like the NKJV Women's Study Bible for $17.99. 10.5 uh, print and it's cloth over board and then one of the best deals in this thing is the NKJV open Bible for $8.99 the King James is not that inexpensive but that is a deal right there that is an incredible deal the unapologetic study Bible pretty good deal there as well the ESV family devotional Bible $9.99. Not a big fan of the ESV. Don't mean to beat a dead horse there, but some of you are. And so now you know. I would rather you read the ESV than a newspaper or something. So, okay. Because you'll get the gospel message. Just maybe not every word. Um, so then we've got like NIV Bible bargains. I didn't mark anything, so... The NIV Investigators Bible Boys Edition. See, it's fourteen ninety nine. It says it's only thirty six ninety nine, but I don't. You know, I, I like stuff like that. But uh, you know, turn this over. More NIV Bibles over here. Did I mark anything over here? No. So I guess I just really didn't see anything that was amazing. You may, you may be saying, ah, Christmas presents or something. Again, I know a lot of people on the channel do and don't like the NIV. We get both, which I appreciate the back and forth. Um, thoughtful gift ideas, morning and evening devotions by David Jeremiah. Some of you need this one. A hundred ways to love your wife and then a hundred ways to love your husband. Sounds good. Um, little workout bottle see to shining sea truth tag I saw that I'm a real big fan of see to shining sea internship for high school credit what work at CBD for high school credit do that but no I think it's I was reading through that I was so fascinated and I marked it um, in his steps one of my favorite books of all time maybe my very best I forget that may have been number one on a recent video I did of top 10 Christian books of all time um, it was somewhere very close but see 249 Charles Sheldon transformative transformative book some people think it goes too much into uh, uh, social gospel but it's just good it's phenomenal buy in bulk of bargains see for Christmas coming up just to give to your church to encourage them during these times of pandemic and all this this is just good stuff um, if you like the ESV man a, uh, vest pocket New Testament Psalms and Proverbs for 249 and then deduct 50 cent each if you get uh, in tens and so that's good let's turn this over buying bulk bargains did I mark anything over here I didn't but there's some things that you might be interested in that uh, the Liberty book interested in me I might just mark that right now for me to look at later but uh, that's good let's just go through a couple more pages because I think we're gonna have to turn this into a part two kind of thing this is a super savings 
section. I don't think I marked anything uh, on that. And after you look at that page, I'll show you um, their little order form. Now, easy to remember, 1-800-CHRISTIAN, or I just punch in CBD, and it's weird, like CBD oil comes up in all this, but that's also the name of Christian Book Distributor, CBD. But like the ancient modern Bible, see to me, $31.99, that's kind of expensive. It's kind of expensive, the Maxwell Leadership Bible. Oh, I did have this uh, marked, the NKJV Holman Study Bible Large Print Edition. Pretty good deal. Church of the Small Things. Um, also, their communion wear is 50% off. The remembrance wear, which I'm not, I'm acquainted with Artistic and Sudbury. Artistic may be a little better than Sudbury, but, but they're both very good. I'm not acquainted with remembrance wear, but it's half price for little things. That, sir, that's a really good deal. And now we come into some major inventory reduction, small print, and you may notice some things marked there. May notice that. And a uh, lot here. So you'll want to just call like 1 800 Christian to get on their mailing list. Go to cb.com, get on their mailing list, join their little $5 thing, which I'm not a part of. But when I was, I think it was worth the $5. And uh, I'm looking at Saving a Sick America by Michael Brown, which I am a Mike Brown fan um, in a lot of ways. The Gospel According to Paul by John MacArthur. I've got some of these marked. Hope for the same sex attracted. Uh, speaking of homosexuality by Joe Douse. Okay, and... Uh, Stuff like that. Apologetics, answering the toughest questions about God and the Bible by Stan Jantz. Two ninety nine. I mean, that's tough to beat. So a lot of these I've got marked here. God's Weapons uh, by Dr. Bill Heyman. The old prophet supposedly out in there. The story of Richard Wormbrand. I've got that really marked. Like I want to get that world religions. So just a lot of stuff. So we're going to end right there. And if you never read another book outside of Scripture, please be sure you just read Scripture. Prayerfully know what other books you're supposed to read. Paul evidently read things that weren't necessarily Christian by the quotes that he made, you know, 1 Corinthians 15, 33, and Acts 17, other quotes, uh, Titus chapter 1. But, uh, you know, just be led of God. And again, if I've gone years and only read the Bible and God would say, okay, I want you to read this, that, and the other. So just be led of the Spirit. So God bless. Talk with you later in Jesus' name.